Hey guys, Big Flip here. This is a heads up video for the weekend of January 13th. We will be streaming the 13th and the 14th, which is Friday and Saturday nights at 6 p.m. Mountain Time. We'll be doing an auction slash coin roll hunt. Um, I just scored up a bunch of cool stuff, ran up to Denver, had um, my coin shop come through with some really, really nice, nice items. Um, we have some Benjis, some Ikes, some W coins. We have um, nickels. We have some Merc dimes. We have a nice right here, a seated that is graded. We also have a bust here that is graded. Um, we went through C three or four CCs last weekend for a really, really good deal. So if you're looking for a really good deal um, during an auction, you might want to check us out. Uh, we start at 6 p.m. Mountain Time. We're going to have plenty of foreign coins, plenty of constitutional, plenty of constitutional that will be graded. Then this is the new box I picked up. This box is incredible. It's got some super, super neat ancients um, that, well, you have to come in and see these. These these coins are neat. I have ancients in here, and then I have coins from the 16s, the 17s, and the 18s. Um, I have a medieval coin. I have a bunch of foreign that I picked up last weekend up in Denver that we didn't make our way through. And then also, um, we have plenty of Morgan slabs, things like that. So if you're interested um, in anything, all you have to do is go to the spreadsheet that will be pinned in the chat during the stream. You can go to the spreadsheet and it will give you a kind of a time frame. You know that if we got through 10 lots in an hour, then it's three hours away to get to the one lot that you're looking at. I think spreadsheets are awesome and it gives everybody a great um, ability to see what's up and coming and a time frame. There's always 10, 15, 20 pieces that are outside of the auction list for the evening that you can look at and if you want to see during the auction, I can show them to you. So there will probably be 20 pieces down below that aren't up for auction, but if you want to see them and um, you want to you want to bin them out, then that's fine too. Those items on the bottom are usually bin. We don't bring them up and then auction them. There's a bin price down there, and all you have to do is just say, "Hey, I would like to see that five ounce quarter Anax graded, whatever." We'll bring it up if you're interested in it. There's a bin price there. You just buy it outright. So auction tonight. Coin roll hunt tonight. I have plenty of boxes. If anybody's looking for a coin roll hunt, um, I all my coins in my coin roll hunts are government backed one ounces that I give back to you. There's no bullion here. It's all government backed. Usually, um, the newer stuff, not a bunch of the old, you know, three and four and five year old stuff that everybody has. I work really, really hard to keep up on um, the government backed one ounces that people don't have. We also will have gold tonight. Um, it's $65 a gram, and we do have reef gold, and then we also have nugget gold. So here is a picture of the gold that we will have. There is reef gold over here. There is nugget gold over here. And then I can also sell you some pan gold. And then we have uh, one ounce maples. That will be 85 for a one ounce maple. All my shipping is $5 unless said otherwise. If you go to flat rate, you're going to end up in a $10 bag. So if we are above one pound, um, then you'll be into a flat rate. Now, if you buy one item during my stream, um, my auction, you have the chance to buy in on a bag. This bag is one pound of foreign coins. They're not old ones. But inside here, I have seated two um, old silvers. So the whole bag is not silver. Matter of fact, there's probably no silver in this bag, but it is one pound of foreign. And we're not just saying Canadian or Mexico. This is from around the world. You can pick this up at $20 outright, or if you buy an item, it's $15. Now remember, this kicks you up to a flat rate. This is one pound. 
and it will become so if you buy five items and then you buy this you're into a flat rate flat rate i cover the first five and then you'll cover the next five for anybody who does a coin roll hunt you will pick up the entire price if you do not buy into a coin roll hunt but that's fine if i don't do any coin roll hunting i'm totally good with it i i like coin roll hunting kind of on my own so um but i hope to uh to have everybody in here tonight um, I'm looking forward to a great weekend. Remember, we have Early Bird Trade Day at Silver Keys Place on Saturday. It starts at 11 o'clock. And then it goes over to EC's Place at 2 o'clock. These are all Mountain Time. 11 o'clock Mountain Time, uh, which is Silver Keys. 1 o'clock Mountain Time, which is EC's Place. And then beyond that, um, I don't know what's happening later on in the evening. But I do know that I will be starting at 6 o'clock. Uh, mountain time on Saturday. So, Friday night 6, Saturday night at 6, after two uh, doses of trade day, afternoon trade day, early bird trade day. And then remember, um, Sunday night will also be a flea market deal or trade day also with um, Silver Keys on Sunday. And then Silver Keys also does one on Wednesday. So, if you don't have silver keys, grab her up uh, and um, make sure that you have rung the bell over there so you know when she's doing stuff. Her channel is really, really growing right now, and it's a great place to hang out. And if you want to buy, sell, or trade, get in touch with Silver Keys. There's an email where you can send stuff over there and um, put it. take some really, really nice pictures front and back. So the, the person that's bidding on it knows exactly what they're bidding on. And then always in the description say what the shipping is, what your payment is, whether you have PayPal, Venmo, whatever you do. Um, make sure that um, you're, you're being straightforward with what's going on with the coin. It makes things sell much easier and Silver Keys doesn't have to do as much work. So I think I've done enough. Today is the 13th of January, Friday the 13th. Happy Friday the 13th to everybody. I hope everybody has a great weekend. I hope to see you tonight at 6 p.m. Mountain Time. Until I see you again, do something nice for somebody, pay it forward every chance you get. I'll see you on the next one. Take care, everybody.